More than 1,300 people here at Bob Wrench Stadium were treated to quite the ball game as the Southern Ohio Copperheads came out, overcame a 4-0 deficit, and took down the Licking County Settlers by a final score of 6-4. And Jake, once again, you take away the first couple of innings and a complete effort. Oh yeah, no doubt. I mean, Licking County went up 3-0 in the first, 4-0 after the first two. Jake Harper really struggled, settled down after that, got the win, and he was fantastic after those first two innings. Uh, and as Coach Chris Ward said, you know, he pulled his uh, pulled himself up by his bootstraps and, <laughs> and got things together, but then the offense chipped away, you know, one run at a time and got back into this game. And then Ben Otto with the two-run home run that provided the fireworks on the field on fireworks night and got the, the team the win against a team they'd already lost to and to start a big homestand against a, a very good looking county team now all alone in third place in the league. After the game we talked to Jake Harper and Ben Otto, two of the guys that were most important in this victory and they told us about what they did to be successful tonight and also what it was like to play in front of a crowd this big. I settled down, it was good, the uh, energy was good, everyone was yelling, I mean, it's probably 10 kids behind the dugout screaming the entire time so and yelling at the other players so it was, it was fun. It was definitely important. I mean, it was big coming back from the All-Star break and starting off strong, especially with uh, Lincoln County. They're, uh, I believe they're one of the better teams out in the league right now. And um, and to come out and do that, it was, it was pretty special, especially with the fans. Following yet another victory for Southern Ohio, they are now 11-3 in their last 14 games, and they're 15-8 and overall, third place right now in the GLSCL. And they'll be right back in action tomorrow as they have a doubleheader against the Cincinnati Steam. It is a big set of games here at Bob Wren Stadium, so make sure you come out to the park. If you can't do so, check out Jake and I on the radio. As always, we'll be on Power 105 here in Athens, or you can go to the website at copperheadbaseball.com and click on the home link to listen in to us. And also, always say make sure you look into the rest of our forms of media we have the facebook page the twitter page at go copperheads and most importantly our youtube page search copperheads baseball and you'll find us right there we are constantly updating that page but with that being said he's been jacob corrigan i've been ryan boyd and this has been another copperheads victory six to four over licking county